I feel like uh, the divine feminines, you guys, you know your worth. We all know our worth out here. Um, yeah, somebody, there's a masculine energy that doesn't like that, okay? They don't like the fact that you're turning your back on the situation, and I feel like um, they're on the verge of confessing something to you. There's a karmic energy who's watching you like a hawk online, probably um, under a fake um, profile or something like that, right? And I feel like they're trying to look up anything from your past so that they can try to use it against you. Because they know once this, once this masculine breaks free from the situation, they may already be single. They're going to give you a pop-up here. And I feel like it's the karmic here who's in denial. The karmic is in denial and has uh, irrational reasoning, okay? Yeah, they're, they're in high anxiety. That I feel like they're either already pregnant or they're trying to trap somebody with a pregnancy here. They're scared. They're panicky. They're thinking of anything they can do. I feel like that's why they're, they're researching you, Divine Feminines, to try to see um, what they can dig up on you to use against you, right? And they're trying to think of a plan to trap your person at the same time. They're, they're having a lot of anxiety right now. They're in a panic state. Um, clarify this current... Thank you. Yeah, current status available. Um, your person, I feel like they have given, they have cut off this karmic very harshly. They, they don't want to have anything to do with this karmic because they're going crazy. Because this is borderline kind of crazy. Okay? Scared, panicked, a lot of anxiety. Uh, stalking people online. They could even just be stalking outside your home, watching you, whatever they can do to watch you, they're doing it. And they're digging up things about you. So they're really doing their homework on you right now, Divine Feminine. Trying to dig up things from your past, anything that they can. Anything that they can so they can sabotage you with it. Okay? Um, clarify pop-up. Yeah, this person, I feel like this masculine, um, they, need to, they need to clear out this energy first, this karmic energy, because if the karmic is watching you this closely, they're watching the masculine as well. And I feel like if they find out that the masculine comes towards you, this karmic is going to be right behind them. They just cut off this karmic, and the karmic is, yeah, see, they're keeping track of everybody's movements right now. And they know it's only a matter of time before your masculine reaches out to you, because they know that they're in love with you. Yeah, they're tuned in. Yeah, they're, they're constantly on the internet trying to find out what's going on. Like, this is somebody who goes back and forth from one Facebook page to the next, all day. This is what they do all day, this karmic, while they plan on how they're going to trap this masculine. Money, heartstrings, possibly a pregnancy. Um, yeah, but they know that it, there's just, your masculine right now is literally lusting for you, but that's really just a side note. They know that this masculine has a passion for you, and they're not going to be able to let you go. Yeah, because this is a twin flame soulmate connection. Twin flame. Clarify um, anchor chains and weighed down. This masculine is trying to, I feel like they're trying to balance out their emotions a little bit. They're trying to get a grip because they are about to come forward and, and uh, tell you everything. Yeah, they're already trying to, they're trying to, now they're telepathically communicating with you right now. <laughs> or they're trying to, okay? I feel like you're disconnected. You're not, you're not listening to it. If you are getting the messages, you're, you're not, you've got a block against this person, I feel. Um, but yeah, they, I feel like they're, they're going to want to tell you 
that um, they took out the trash. They 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 got rid of this karmic that they cut free. That they cut the karmic free. Um, so they're they're right now they're really focused on you, focused on this communication. What they have to do next, okay? Um, and they want to tell you they're trying to cut off this karmic without coming towards you yet because they know this karmic is watching and they know if they show up remember with pop-up and cleansing that this karmic is sure to follow right i heard mary had a little lamb and the lamb was sure to follow but this person is wishing for you they're yearning for you right now yeah they're doing a lot of praying I just feel like this goes along with the telepathic. Um, they could be trying to contact you or um, they could be picking up uh, messages through dreams, songs. You could see this person in a dream. Like, uh, you know, everything's going great in your dream and all of a sudden they kind of pop up in your dream, right? And you wake up like, oh, like you start cleansing your, your energy. I could see somebody doing that. Um, so yeah, um, this person's trying everything that they can to meditate on you. Really focused in on you right now, okay? So whether they're trying to send the, the telepathic communication or not, that I feel like they, they're doing it anyway, just because they're so focused on you. Um, trying to get that grip before they come forward and communicate with you. Yeah, they want to put some things in the past with you here, Divine Feminine. This is a um, two of cups kind of situation here. They want, to, they want to try to compromise or come to some type of agreement. You know, yeah, they're about ready to reach out. They know that you're the one that they want. And I'm telling you, the more they do that, the more crazy this karma gets. I got to say, that, I mean, this does this look sane to you? Um, I feel like this karmic is really upset um, and embarrassed because they tried so hard to make this situation look like it was freaking perfect, right? That it was the perfect connection. Everybody was happy. Everything was wonderful, right? But behind closed doors, I feel like, this karma kept getting more and more threatened by you and this connection. And as time went on, they just, they seemed to get crazier and crazier. And now they're thinking of plans to entrap somebody. I mean, this person's raging. They're raging. And that's, that. this is why. It's, it's the way that this karmic has reacted, okay, that has made this masculine cut them off. And I feel like this karmic blames you for that, but you've had nothing to do with it. You've had nothing to do with it. You've actually treated, you've been treated in this situation like you don't even exist. You know, you've been completely ignored. You've been completely isolated. And you've been working on yourself and doing the work on yourself, right? Enough to complete this, this cycle. So you haven't had anything to do with this Divine Feminine. And, um, and the masculine saw to that. That was by the masculine's choice. Not yours, but the masculine's. So really, the only person they have to blame here in this, uh, what people, is them and this masculine. That's it. The masculine is to blame because they pushed you away they push their blessing and love away, okay? A divine blessing, and they chose this karmic. And then from that moment on, the karmic felt threatened. And then this karmic turned into a, I don't know. Uh, well, they've always been karmic, but, I mean, it just keeps getting worse and worse and worse, you know? Like, they, the more threatened they get, the, the crazier they get. The more threatened they get, the more they, they stalk you. The, the angrier they get, the more they, they uh, um, lash out in a fit of rage, you know. 
And now that they're embarrassed because they're, you know, the facade that they tried to keep for the community is, is falling down. The divine is no, the masculine is no longer there. Sorry. The divine masculine is no longer around. They cut them off. So what are they going to say to the community now? Now it's making them look like a fool. They're embarrassed. They can't keep up the appearances anymore. This person's been cut off. They're alone. And they're very, it's beyond threatened at this point. It's beyond threatened for this person at this point. Okay? But you, I feel like you're just done. You still, you have nothing to do with any of this. As your back is turned, all of this is going on. You would have no way of knowing this. Um, besides your intuition and watching tarot, right? <laughs> but your person wants to put all of this behind you. Um, this masculine, they want to put it all in the past. And they, they really want their Ace of Cups here. They want their soulmate connection. Yeah, they're about to take a big risk. Either them or this karmic. I don't know. Clarify this um, gamble. Taking a risk. Oh, no, yeah. I feel like it's the karmic. It did land on top of the karmic here. Feeling threatened. I feel like this karmic could be like doing some kind of drugs or something with the highest high and the adrenaline rush. I feel like they're so threatened and... They're, it's almost to the point where they're chemically imbalanced at this point. Some of the, like this karmic may even have some mental issues with anxiety and threatened and this makeup. Yeah, I think they may have some mental issues, okay? And it's just making things worse. The more stressed out they get about this, the worse everything gets with this karmic, okay? And seriously, I really want you guys to be aware of your surroundings when you're out and about. Um, you know, stay, stay um, alert, I guess I want to say, because these, this karmic here is about to freaking go off, okay? They are. They're going to flip out. It's them, I feel, who is about to take some kind of risk. Take some kind of gamble. And your person over here, they're just really reminiscing. They're really focused in on your energy. They're, they both are. Um, in This one in a negative way. This masculine in a positive way. But honestly, um, both of these people are trying to pull on your energy. Okay, so you may start feeling kind of fatigued at this time. You really need to stay alert right now. Okay, Divine Feminine? And whatever it is you're posting out there, man, you got to be careful about what you post or put out on the Internet. Because I, in no way am I joking. This karmic here, I feel like um, they may have some mental issues, and they're literally about to freaking explode. Okay, I feel like both of them are on the verge. Your person's on the verge of coming towards you. Um, and this karmic is on the verge of literally just snapping. Okay, they're going to snap. They could have a family. And, and look, look at them. Look at them watching you here. Look at them watching you. Um, I feel like they're, they're, they may be trying to protect a family here. I'm feeling this protective sense. I feel like this envy, jealousy. Um, I feel like um, they had some dreams for a happy family here, and that could be crumbling for them. Like, they're seriously, they're starting to um, lose their mind a little bit. They're, they're only focused on you. Uh, this person could be getting headaches. Um, with blood and this, I feel like if they're not careful, this person could even have a stroke. Seriously, they're that stressed out. But that's not for all of you, okay? But yeah, you're leaving the scene and your person, even though you have your back turned, 
your person still wants you. Even though you're having a new beginning, this masculine still wants you. E you know, even though you don't have anything to do with this, this masculine still wants you. And that's driving this karmic insane. It doesn't matter what they try, what plan they have, how much, uh, how, how much they're um, stalk cyber stalking you. It doesn't matter if they're keeping notes. It doesn't matter. They're, you know what? They're irrational reasoning. They're losing, they're losing their mind because they can't stop this masculine from loving you. Even though you don't want to be a part of this, this masculine is going to start chasing you. I'm telling you. Um, yeah, there's the masculine. Yeah. Yeah, so I feel like there is a legal divorce going on, and that's just going to create even more waves of emotion for this person. Man, this, this karmic's under a lot of pressure. It, don't I have that? Pressure cooker. I'm telling you, they're ready to explode. It says so right here. They're raging. And I feel like, yeah, um, they're going through a divorce right now. Your masculine has cut them off. When they, if they haven't gotten these divorce papers, when they do, they're they're gonna be, they're not gonna know what to do. It's gonna be like a combination of panic, anxiety, sadness, fear, embarrassment, crazy. And then when they find out that your person wants to propose to you. I feel like it's going to get even worse. It's just going to keep getting progressively worse. This karmic here is losing it. I'm, and I'm, I'm kind of, th it almost looks to me like they could have a stroke because of all the pressure. So I, I seriously don't, I hope that doesn't happen to anybody. You know, I don't want that to happen to anybody. But yeah, that's kind of the feeling that I'm getting here. I'm seeing this as a vein that just kind of some of these some of these karmics could be, you know, having some kind of trouble trouble soon because of the stress. And still, you keep ascending, you keep leveling up. That makes them even more angry. You keep you keep leveling up and here's the stairs here, here's the stairs here. Um, you're ascending. You still have your back turned. <laughs> you have your back turned in every single picture here. Seriously. All right. And your person, I feel like this masculine, they're trying to avoid the karmic. I feel like they're going to start chasing after you. I really do. Because you're leaving, you're leaving, you're leaving. Leaving, leaving, leaving. Done. Divine Feminine has left the building. And here comes this masculine. They're going to start chasing after you. They're trying to avoid this karmic at all costs. During this divorce case, I feel like um, they're, somebody's going to have to move. Yeah. There could be a property that, um, that may need to be sold. But yeah, I feel like your masculine is, is moving. They may even um, need to travel towards you. This masculine may have to move closer to you. But this this karmic, oh my gosh, they're gonna they're gonna lose their minds, guys. Um, you could be noticing some repetitive numbers right now. You know, uh, eleven, eleven, two, 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 three, three, three. It's because this masculine is on their way back. Look at all the infinity signs, right? They're on their way back because this person wants to commit to you now. But I feel like, I mean, it's so, this energy, I can't really describe it to you. It's very, very intense. Your person's energy feels intense. This karmic energy feels a bit scary, I got to say. I'm going to say it because they're, they're losing their minds. They're scary. They're, they're scared. They're panicked. Um, they're having these waves of emotion, things that they can't, they can't control their state of thinking anymore. Okay. Um, 
Yeah, they're they're gonna snap, guys. This person's gonna pop, I'm telling you. And with every day that goes by, they get more and more stressed out. And here you are, all of this is going on behind the scenes. You don't see anything. You've got your back turned in every in every picture here. All right, let me get some tarot on it, okay? I'm hearing the song Tom Petty. I think it's Tom Petty. Don't come around here no more. Don't come around here no more. Yeah. So I feel like you you just don't want to have anything to do with this. Um yeah, see, here's that karmic, right? Watching, 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 stalking you, stalking everything. And here you are, moving forward, and here's the masculine. Wish fulfillment, wanting to come and give you this offer that's taken way too long. I can't make it up. This is, this is your stalker right here, the main one. The main one, that's this, uh, this karmic individual. They could be possibly an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, but they don't have to be. And you know, Divine Feminine, you could be any sign out here. Um, if, the, if the title drew you into this video, there's something in it for you. So, yeah, I feel like this masculine wants to take some kind of action here towards you, man. They choose you. They choose you. They could even be afraid, maybe worried that you've got somebody new. Um, there could be people in their family or friends. Um, one, this person could have other options, right, that are kind of fighting for their attention. But they could have other people who are kind of um, encouraging this person to come towards you. All right, but this person, they want to choose you. They've got a lot of love inside for you here. They, but you ha they haven't told you yet. So you have no way of knowing all of this is going on besides your intuition. And you're moving forward into a new cycle. This is you leveling up, ascending. It's right here. Moving up these stairs, okay? That's this. You're leveling up. You're moving up in your life. And I feel like you're closing out this cycle. You've got your back turned. You're energetically saying goodbye. And you're disconnecting. And this masculine, as much as they try to contact you um, telepathically, energetically, they can't. They can't reach you anymore. I feel like you're just not listening for them, or you just have them um, energetically blocked, right? Yeah. Yes. I feel like very soon this you're gonna get you're gonna hear something. Clarity is coming in here about the situation. Somebody is gonna tell you something, or yeah, I feel like it's this masculine. They they're on the verge of talking to you, um, and for justice to be out here, they know they have to make something right. And I feel like it's the fact that they chose to give to a karmic individual instead of you. And they thought that you had nothing to bring to the table. With You were the only one here with a patch on your blanket. They could have met you during a time that you were struggling maybe or didn't have a lot of money or something like that. Okay, and I feel like they just left you sitting here. They completely ignored you, even though they knew that you were waiting for the truth. Now I'm seeing these balanced, right, these scales. And it's time to balance the scales now. If this person knows, they've always known, they needed to make this right. For justice to be here, I know there was an, a major injustice done to you. And they need to make this right. They need to bring you the clarity and the communication that you have needed. Okay? So, yeah, that's this person here. And they don't want to let you go. That's for sure. They don't want to let you go. And I feel like, too, I, I usually see this, this little guy, like somebody who is feeling intimidated, kind of scared. Scared to come forward. That's why they're trying to get a grip right? 
They're trying to control their emotions a little bit so they can come in and talk. Um, because this person's really guarded. They don't want you to hurt them the same way they hurt you. They don't want to be rejected. They want this new beginning, right? But they know they've juggled you for far too long. So they're worried about you rejecting them, Divine Feminine. But they know they need to make this right. They need to balance these scales and bring justice to a situation where it was unjust. They need to boss up. This person needs to boss up. Take control of their life. Get the courage they need to come forward. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, to the one. You are the one for them. This is wifey. Yeah, look. Empress. An apology. This person's getting ready to apologize. I'm telling you, it's all kind of coming together here very quickly. This masculine's on the verge of talking to you and trying to make things right. And this karmic is on the verge of losing their mind. Okay? They're losing their mind here. So be very careful because you've got a karmic out here on the freaking prowl. Okay? All right. Um, what more can you show me about this karmic? Show me this karmic. Clarify this page of swords, please, divine. But you're moving forward. It's very clear to see. But this, this masculine keeps trying to pull your energy back. And I don't think it's working anymore. You've broken free. From this this one wants to come out yeah I feel like this person's just angry this is rage to me it just feels like a, like they're burning right a burning rage because your person is walking away they're walking away they've got their back turned to this karmic they don't want to have anything to do with this karmic if the, if the karmic calls them, which I feel like they are, your person does it. They're trying to avoid this karmic. Okay? So they're not talking to them right now. They're not around them right now. Okay, what else can you show me about this karmic? Clarify the page of swords. What can you show me about this karmic? This one wants out. Yeah, you're pre they, they're upset because they know your person wants to come to you with a cup of love. And it's literally, it's making them crazy. They're raging, waves of emotion. They can't control their emotions. They can't control their rage. They can't control their stalking. They blame all of this on you, even though it's clear to me you don't have any part of it. They're angry. They're... They're losing their minds, man. They're losing their minds. And they know that your person is going to make you an offer. Um, I just saw the collaboration card on the bottom of the deck. Give me... Thank you. Yeah, you're an earth angel. A star. That's another reason why they're upset. Because y you continue to win Divine Feminine because you're divinely led. You're a light worker. You're a divine feminine, and this person can't compete. They can't compete with the star and an earth angel. They, how, 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 and an empress, how? How are they going to compete with this? This karmic has been competing with you since they found out about this connection. Okay, and they just can't anymore. They can't compete with you. They've tried to be you, Divine Feminine, and they can't. You can't duplicate an earth angel, a star, um, an empath, a healer, someone who's intuitive, completely tapped into the divine. You know, I feel like, too, you could be putting yourself out there in the public eye. You could be... Um, yeah. For all I know, you could have like your own podium out here somewhere, uh, even on YouTube or whatever you're doing. You're attracting a lot of attention, and it's because you're a divine being. This karmic, when they snap, they're going to know they're going after a divine being. 
And that's a big no-no. You don't do that. Okay, they're playing with fire here. I'm telling you, rage ready to explode. And then I, I keep seeing this card here. So this person could really end up suffering for going up against a divine feminine. In no way am I joking. They can clearly see who you are and what you are. And they still want to go up against you. Mm -mm -mm. You know what? <laughs> and look who comes out. The higher font. Yeah, that's a big fat no. This person's going to be stopped dead in their tracks. And I, I, I hate to say it like that because I am sensing a stroke here. I'm sensing somebody having some kind of stroke or some kind of mental issue. I don't know what this is. But they had better back off this earth angel. You guys are being protected. These karmics better be careful. Because if they knowingly go up against an earth angel, they're going to get such bad karma for that. The divine's not having that. Yeah, they have no idea what's going to happen to them if they start fighting with an earth angel. They have no idea what's coming. I, I can't even tell. The Divine's like, you let us handle it. Seriously, you let us handle this. The Divine's not having it. They're standing right in front of you, protecting you. Yeah, yeah, I feel like if the Divine wants you guys to reunite, it's going to happen. Boom. The divine is like, this is what's really going to happen. Sit down and watch. Okay? If the divine wants the soulmate connection together, it's going to happen. Whatever God wants. Okay? So, yeah, I feel like um, the karmic's going to be sat down. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't think I want to know either. Um, I don't, I think you want to keep your nose out of it. Stay out of the karma. Stay out of the karma, divine feminine. Just keep moving forward. If the divine wants a soulmate connection together, it will happen. And until then, they're going to make you extremely abundant. While you're single, you will be abundant. Okay? You're growing something of your own. You could be a boss, business owner. You're doing something creative here that's, like, very successful, okay? And it could have something to do with your divine path, right? Um, and how you're healing other people and raising other people's vibes. It's making you very, uh, like, right now, you're very independent. You don't need anyone in this energy. You're happy being single, so just keep moving forward and stay out of this karmic's karma because I'm telling you, man, we don't want to know. We don't want to know what's going to happen to these karmics. I know you guys are like, but I want to know. No, we don't want to know. You keep your nose clean. The divine's got this. They're protecting you. You let them handle it. I'll tell you what, though. Um, they're going to be heartbroken and out in the cold, and um, maybe even living in poverty, that health issues too, they could have some kind of heart issue, or um, why do I keep hearing like blood pressure? The word blood is in here, right there, maybe blood pressure, something. I'm telling you. You are divinely protected, divine feminine. So keep moving forward. Um, build something solid for yourself. Focus on that. If this, if the divine, if God wants a connection together, it, it will come together when it's supposed to. Okay? Anyway, Divine Feminine, that's what I've got for this quick check. 